Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how you uh, connect your card reader into the iProcess application. The first thing you want to do is make sure that your Bluetooth is turned on on your device. Okay, you do not need to pair anything. Then you'll go into your iProcess application. After you've logged in, you will see this page. You're going to click on help. Go to TMS update all the way down on the bottom. And then on your card reader, just make sure it's turned on. Make sure it's like, you know, either flashing green, uh, flashing blue or showing some blue. And then on the top right corner here, right now it says no Bluetooth terminal are connected. So you press on it for a couple of seconds on your card reader. Wait just a second here. And you can see right now that it's already connected. I just pressed on it for two seconds on the card reader. Now you're gonna click on start TMS update. This should not take so long. That's it, you're done. Now you're ready to take payments. You only do the TMS update once. And then you can click on process sale Oops, sorry about that. Start sale, I'm sorry. Click on start sale right here. And you can just put an amount, click on continue, press on charge. And on the card reader, you can go ahead and either tap the device, which is what I'm doing right now, card tapped. And that's it. Click on receipt. And this is my receipt. If you want, you can, you can go ahead and you can void that payment. If you go to history, you click on that card. On the top right corner, you can click on the three lines and you can do a refund or a void. So we're gonna void it now. And now you can see that this transaction is voided. Additionally, you can add products, uh, custom items inside the, uh, inside the uh, app. You don't have to use that if you don't want to, but it's definitely possible. You can use our product manager on our website. I'm gonna show you now how you use the same technology just for you know, basically entering the card, entering the chip card. So you'll put an amount. Here, you can put the names if you'd like. You really don't have to. And then press on charge. This time I'm gonna use the card reader to enter the chip inside. You can see smart card insert. And I can go ahead and I can sign the screen. Payment approved. Would you like to see a digital receipt now? Yes. And this is my receipt. And I can go ahead and I can send that receipt either by text message or by WhatsApp, or I can just void the payment and we're good to go.